Meghan Markle has been ruling the roost since she married Prince Harry last May, according to TV personality Lizzie Cundy. The Duchess of Sussex and Miss Cundy are believed to have met when the then actress traveled to the United Kingdom shortly after starting her sting as Rachel Zane on the show Suits. Speaking to talk radio, Miss Cundy said, One thing I have heard is, because I'm friend with a lot of Harry's friends, one is a very close friend, is that she has pushed them all out. She's ruling the roost. This friend, I won't name him, he had Harry on his shoulders in Las Vegas when he got into that trouble. He was a really good, solid friend, covered for him, everything, he has been elbowed right out. Royal sources have previously claimed Meghan Markle had Prince Harry limit contact with close friends because of their unsettling influence on the Duke of Sussex. The Duchess' attention was said to have focused on childhood friend Tom Skippy in Skip, who met Prince Harry when they enrolled at Eton College in 1998. British magazine Tatler reported in March the feud between Meghan and Mr. Inskip was the result of the close friend challenging Prince Harry on his relationship with her. The article read, Hang out with the Clooney slash Beckham slash Soho house set and be assailed for being too Hollywood, for forcing your henpecked husband to abandon his old, country set muckers, including Tom, Skippy, Inskip, the ultra-loyal, tight-lipped Harry pal, who, it said advised Harry not to marry Meghan and has paid the price, banishment. A source close to the couple told The Sun, but the real reason Tom was made no longer welcome by Meghan is that she had learned he had dared to question Harry over whether he really felt he was doing the right thing in marrying her. All the poor guy did, during a heart-to-heart -heart with the prince, was to venture that Harry might be infatuated, more in lust than love, and maybe he might think about cooling things down before rushing into a proposal. Meghan didn't actually want Tom and his wife Lara at their wedding, but Harry insisted, although they were not invited to the party in the evening, which hurt, because all of their other mutual chums were asked. But the birth of the couple's first son, Archie Harrison, in early May is believed to have soothed the tension between the Duchess and Skippy. Royal insiders have claimed Mr. Inskip was among the first friends Prince Harry phoned when his son was born on May 6. Mr. Inskip is now genuinely happy for the couple and was said to be delighted Harry included him in the celebrations for Archie's birth. The royal source said, one of the first of his old chums with whom Harry wanted to share the great news was Skippy, who was just happy to be back in the fold. Tom is genuinely happy that he was proved wrong about Meghan, because he, like everyone else, can see that they are absolutely devoted to each other. The Duchess has been plagued by persistent rumors of several feuds, including one with sister-in-law Kate, Duchess of Sussex. Speculation spiked after Kensington Palace announced in March Meghan Markle and Prince Harry had received their personal household away from Prince William and Kate. The couple now resides at Frogmore Cottage with one-month-old Archie.